Okay, your name is? My name is Michael Krulik. What, what's your title? I'm an application specialist with uh, Avid out of the Burbank office. There's a lot of interest in subscription-based uh, editing rather than buying the software and then buying the upgrades. Uh, where is Media Composer at? Well, actually, we give you different options when it comes to licensing. You can get a subscription at just starting at $50 a month. That does include support. Uh, and then you can go up from there if you decide to buy for a year uh, we, uh, and committing. We actually you know, offer different options for that. Also, you can get a perpetual license, but the great thing about that is for $1,300 or uh, $1,299 or $1,259, you can actually buy Media Composer outright. And that is uh, Media Composer. You buy it, it's a perpetual license, but for a year you get upgrades and support for that year. Nice thing about after that year, for a very low price, you can continue having that software and upgrades uh, and just keep that going. So in the long run, it's actually a better price. For someone on a limited budget who wants to go month by month, what's the offering? Uh, it starts at uh, $50 a month, $49.99. And you can get that all uh, from our website. If you go to the website, you can actually see starting at and all of the different plans that we do offer. But we offer that for a number of reasons, for the people who are on a budget, but also for those facilities that decide, well, I just need Media Composer for maybe a month or two. You buy it for a month or two, and then you decide if you want to keep it or, you know, or not. Uh, how much storage does that uh, accom uh, accommodate? Uh, well, that's no storage. The storage is something that you would have to provide. We don't know what you're shooting, if you're shooting um, HD, if you're shooting 4K. So the storage aspect is, is on you. You're going to have to decide how you're going to store any of the media that you're shooting. But the software is just loaded onto your system. So it's, it's not like a cloud edit in that, that regard, is it? No, it's not cloud. We do have a product called Media Composer Cloud, and that is actually uh, using our Interplay Asset Management System, Avid Interplay, and our Media Central Services, where you'd be able to log into somebody's facility that has Interplay and be able to download to your local system proxies off of their Nexus or ISIS uh, storage system. But again, that's not something that is a subscription base or something that anybody could log into. You need to have somebody who is on an Interplay platform. How is the uh, Simpty show for Avid? Well, Simpty's been great. It actually was very nice to uh, share information and technology between uh, a lot of peers. It's a very open uh, platform. A lot of people enjoy, again, getting a lot of information or at least coming up to the exhibitors and getting their questions answered as far as uh, technology that's happening now or even in the future.